fight several times a week and this has never happened, so it's alarming. CNN political commentator Angela Rye says she was subjected to a humiliating body search by a TSA agent at the Detroit airport. I just burst into tears because I just, I couldn't believe that's what was happening at TSA. You can see Rye jump back as the agent moves up her leg. Rye says she was selected at random for the pat down. The manager said that he was going to bring an officer to escort me out of the airport because I couldn't, if I didn't subject myself to that level of screening, then I would have to be escorted out. Rye says a police officer talked her into allowing them to search her. Is this recording right now? She asked him to videotape the incident. Rye says she has heard from dozens of people who say they complained to the TSA after experiencing similar incidents, but say they were ignored. Only difference here, Angela Rye knows people. She already has a meeting set with the leadership at the TSA. I worked for the Homeland Security Committee for four years, so I wasn't speaking about this ignorantly. I know that there are some boundaries that they shouldn't cross, per se. Do you think the agent went too far? I don't know that I blame the agent. I blame the policy. Recently, former Inside Edition producer Denise Albert faced a similar issue at a security checkpoint. You can't touch them. Albert was outraged when a TSA agent ignored her protest that she's recovering from breast cancer. As for Rye, she says she hopes her story will prompt changes. The system is the problem, and we need to figure out how to make us safer without causing this type of alarm, fear, and humiliation of the nation's citizens. The TSA told us they investigated and concluded their security protocols were followed and are designed to prevent specific terrorist acts, but they say they regret the distress the process may have caused.